my recent bad experiences with the Celestron and the uh, Mead mounts has soured me on the two mainstream manufacturers. So I went looking for alternative mounts and uh, I found the Ioptron as Mount Pro as a possibility. Found one on Cloudy Nights in Virginia. It just arrived. Let's see what's in it. It is well packaged. It is a used mount, by the way. I have great hopes for what it can do. All right. First box open. There is a second box inside it. That's good. I'm gonna leave it in and just cut it open. Oh, this is nice. Look what I see. The mount comes in a nice, oh boy, this is heavy. It comes in a nice case. An Ioptron case. Let's open the case. Oh boy, this is heavy. <laughs> and see what's in it. Manual, which start guide. Let's hope the wind does not blow them all over the yard. Engine spring, power supply, screws, nuts, bolts. And then the mount itself. Let's see if I can fumble my way into taking it out. It is heavy. All right, let's try this way. Making progress. Okay, it is a heavy mount. There we go. And there it is. That is the Osman D as well as Vixen. dovetails and uh, this is the the extension for the counterweight it's supposed to hold 33 pounds as the maximum weight plus an additional 10 pound counterweight my edge HD 11 inch is 28 pounds if I put the guide scope as part of the counterweight I may be able to get away with it let me see where the hand box is There's the hand box. There's the cable. And I don't know what this is for. But I'm looking forward to testing it. Not until after the eclipse. 
I'll be heading over to Oswego tomorrow to get ready to go live with four telescopes. But for now, I am very happy with my new project. This is the Ioptron as Mount Pro. It weighs about 12 pounds, not too bad compared to the much, much, much heavier mount that I have now. It is supposed to be a level and go. So, I will share with you first light when we have first light. In the meantime, so long from the Pompeii Observatory.